Hello everyone and welcome back to the Butler Blue vlog. Evan here with Butler Blue and uh, just at my desk here in the office here in Robertson Hall. It is officially fall break or I think like tomorrow. Uh, today is Wednesday and uh, fall break for Michael's kids too so he is out for the week and um, Brittany is too. So uh, just me and old Trip Dog here. Uh, for for this episode of the vlog here so we're just gonna follow me around because things have not slowed down at all uh, we got a few things on the horizon you're gonna want to be aware of Bulldog Beauty Contest October 26 at 930 it's happening next this is next Saturday you're watching this Friday there'll be a week and a day so I'm gonna be downstairs packing a lot of that stuff up we're gonna show you some prizes that we're giving away for that um, and kind of all the ins and outs of what it takes to like the behind the scenes part of that uh, Blues Buddies, we'll show you a little Blues Buddies update. Also starting next week, if homecoming in the beauty contest wasn't enough, Butler Bound starts next week. So we are going to be making our first surprise admission deliveries of the season next week. So i got to pack a few kits up. I'll show you what's going to be in the swag bags this year for the Blues Buddies, and uh, or for the Butler Bound, sorry, a lot of B alliterations in this program. Butler Bound, Butler Beyond, Bulldog Beauty Contest, Blues Buddies, all of them, all the B alliterations. So I'll show you what uh, is going to be in our swag bags this year. Give you a little sneak preview of that. Um, yeah, kind of be like a home vlog, except instead of a home vlog, it's an office vlog. Just going to see what I do for the next few days. Also supposed to be getting a camera in soon. Uh, it's a DJI Osmo Pocket. So it's not going to be really for vlogging per se. It's going to be more of like a handheld gimbal camera. And... Uh, so it's gonna help us with basketball games and uh, kind of filming all that. Someone's texting me. Oh well. Well, let's see what we can see. Trip, you got anything else to add? I think he's good. All right, let's get to work. I don't know if you can see it, but the Blue Mobile's right there. What I wanted this vlog to be this week was our new 2019 Ford Transit Connect. We have a new Blue Mobile, new wrap, and everything. We don't have it yet. So. Maybe in two weeks, two or three weeks when we get it, we'll make a vlog about it. We'll do a pimp my ride. We'll see, see if it comes in. But it's gonna be awesome. Chibi say hi. Chibi say hi. Chibi say hi. You wanna get to work? You wanna hug first? <laughs> okay. Oh, everything's great. <laughs> All right, got something else to figure out here. We're behind Robertson. Here is the Butler Blue golf cart. Pretty cool. So we use this a lot during homecoming, shuttle trip around. We'd love to shuttle like Gideon from I've Pet That Dog around. If you're not aware, Gideon from I've Pet That Dog, check him out on Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram. He is going to be a special guest judge. So that's cool and all, it's charging, it looks great. Um. That's usually how we get it out. So I'm gonna have to figure out somehow this week uh, how to get it out. Cause it can't go this way. Cause it's not gonna fit up those stairs. And then it can't go around the back patio because there's a, there's a big old dip off. So uh, leave your comments below how you think we should do it. My thoughts are either like rent a crane or maybe get a ramp. So I thought maybe I could just like out walk the fence to see if uh, it would work. I mean there's a gap, but there's also that big tree in the way. And then that's just straight woods. And then the other section of the fence is legitimately bolted down to our building, Robertson. And then all of these other, like this is in the ground. Maybe we need to get another golf cart. You want a little breakfast trip? Got a little banana. You good? That make you happy. That give you the wiggles. <laughs> that make you all excited. You love bananas. You got, hey Trippy. Do you have the butt wiggles? Are you the wigglers? You got little wiggles going on? Woo! 
Hey Trippy. Hey, hey Trip. Are you the, are you the Butler Bulldog? Hey, are you the Butler Bulldog? Oh my goodness, you getting all excited? You got the zooms and the wiggles. All the wiggles. Hey everyone, and welcome to the lovely Robertson Hall basement. Uh, basically, where we keep all of our things, including all the Blues Buddies stuff, right back there. We'll get to Blues Buddies in a second. But first, I think we are all packed up for the beauty contest here. So let's just kind of go through everything we got here. So uh, we have our bibs for all the registrants. They look like license plates. They're pretty awesome. Um, so if your bulldog registers, this is the uh, bib you put on them. Underneath the bibs, we have our certificates. We have one for our winners, for our, uh, for our con uh, categories, which are most beautiful bulldog. Best mean mug, best dress slash costume, best bulldog human tandem. So like if you and your bulldog dress up alike, the best trick, most butler spirit, Mr. and Mrs. Mr. and Ms. Bulldog congeniality, and that's judged throughout the entire competition. Usually, is like the sassy bulldog, and then of course best in show. And then the runner-ups for all of that as well. And then every participant gets one too, but you really want one of these. We have our clipboard for me and Michael to be able to uh, know what's happening. We'll have all of our registrants on there. Uh, these are super important dry erase boards because that is what our judges will be using to rate each dog. And each dog will get a rating that to basically, or that to basically pick one dog to win each category, and whoever uh, gets the most votes to win wins that category. Speaking of winning, we'll get to the prizes in a second. But one of our celebrity guest judges is Gideon from I've Pet That Dog. So we'll put his info down below, but you're going to want to check him out. It's going to be awesome. Uh, to, what else we got in here? To go along with the um, dry erase boards, we have some erasers. We have all of our expo markers and pins, some duct tape, safety pins, so you can put your um, your bibs on your dog's costume, as well as bowls. We have all of our bowls here for our dogs, so we'll have water set up. We created two new banners for homecoming this year. Um, so this banner, if you've been to the beauty contest before, you know we have this the super screen where we uh, have a camera that I'll be running and uh, we can put the beauty contest up on that screen so you can see it better and we also live stream it as well so be sure to look out for that on Tripp's Facebook page but we're able to put a banner on on the bottom of the super screen this year so I wasn't able to unroll it all the way because of space and this one doesn't need to be laid flat this other one over there that I'll talk about in a second needed to be laid out flat um, but basically we have this nice butler logo here a big beauty contest logo and then the uh, Butler Blue Live mascot logo as well on that. So that will be on behind the beauty contest this year. And then speaking of Blues Buddies. So Blues Buddies perk this year, um, we've mentioned it a few times on the vlog, is that our Blues Buddies Kids Club members get to walk in the homecoming parade with Trip this year. So that's super awesome. That will be at 11 o'clock on, ho oh, ran into a wall, on homecoming morning. And so we created this little banner. So we'll, we're gonna buy some poles um, I'm thinking like a shower curtain maybe. Um, so traditional like parade style. We can have two of the kids holding onto this banner. Um, this one's rolled up super tight. So we're using some of Tripp's bones from last year that I need to figure out if we're gonna like sell or not or auction off. Leave a comment below if you wish we'd, we would. We've done a few giveaways with them, but if, if we would auction them off, would you bid on them? Um, but we're getting that all laid out. Um, we are gonna be selling Blues Buddies kits at a trailer again this year. So packing up for that, um, not very, too much is packed up yet because hopefully we're still going to sell some Blues Buddies kits. Um, I'll put the sign up information below um, before because this is Wednesday. This is about 10 days before homecoming. So I have our sock model over there, just some business cards. Uh, we had these buttons made last year for special events that say I'm one of, I'm one of Blues Buddies. And then we'll go back over here to our actual Blues Buddies headquarters. And um, basically we'll just pack up all these kits. We'll pack up the official member card set. We'll get all those and then our label makers. So basically we'll have, a, we'll have all of this at homecoming. 
um, to set to sign up kids for Blues Buddies. We just want to make sure we can do some sell, selling of Blues Buddies, you know, the week leading up to homecoming. Probably should mention this Ohio State football pylon and why it's why I'm using it. It's heavy, so that's partially why I'm using it to hold this down. But like two years ago, we went to Orlando for a conference, and there was a vendor selling pylons, and uh, Chip got a hold of one. So I think that's everything downstairs. Um, over here, in that tub right there, is some of the Butler Bound merchandise that I'm going to be, or not merchandise, Butler Bound giveaways that um, we're going to be putting together, because Butler Bound starts next week. Starting on Wednesday, I believe, will be our first visit. And so we're going to head upstairs now. I'm going to kind of get all that organized and see if I can pack up some, some Butler Bound kits. Um, so I can show you guys what's going to be in those kits this year because it's going to be pretty legit. So uh, let's go upstairs. All right, so I just spent about the last hour getting all of our Butler Bound stuff kind of organized, making sure I had enough for each kit. Um, so what I'll do is I'll overlay some footage I just took of what our, I call our Butler Bound drawer. Um, and that's going to house all of our Butler Bound stuff. So you can just kind of see what we do, kind of the behind the scenes look of what it takes to uh, pack up a bag. And we do pack up bags for every person. So um, it's not like we're packing out bags beforehand. I'm going to pack up that bag when I know we're going to go visit a student. Um, kind of makes it a little bit more personal. Um, I do want to say that these are subject to change. Um, so I'm going to go through our current kit. But um, spoiler alert, there are some stickers in here and a poster. Um, the poster, we might update the poster, we might want to do a different poster depending if we're getting cool pictures throughout the year. Um, same with the stickers, we might just keep them fresh, keep them rolling. So, um, the exact kit might change, so I just want to put that disclaimer out here now. If, if, you're, if you're a high school senior and um, you might be thinking about coming to Butler and you do happen to get a trip visit, that'd be awesome, um, in case your kit looks a little different. Um, so let's get started. The first piece is the most important piece, and if I have to have one thing in this kit, um, it is this. And it is the Butler Bound poster. It's the most important thing. It's the what we take pictures of um, for with the students of they hold this up and trips right next to them. So it has to be in every single folder or every single um, bag here. Oh, the bag by the way, super cool. Butler Blue branded, nice canvas bag. Um, super important. What you may not see all the time is the back side of it. And it's actually, it's called Top 10 Reasons uh, to be a Butler Bulldog next year. So it just goes through um, 10 different reasons, like a class size is really small, how we focus on experiential learning, um, it mentions trip, because why not? Uh, so that's cool. So that's the most important thing. It's so important that I even keep just a handful of these in the Blue Mobile at all times. Um, just in case I packed a bag and forgot one, you got to have this for, for the social media post. So that is always in the bag. Um, Next, it's kind of a standard that we do in our giveaways. It's the Butler Blue autograph. And then the back, some information about Butler Blue. Um, but this is always a standard. It's kind of our standard giveaway. What else do we have in here? Um, trip head. So we got this from our admissions folks here in marketing. Um, it's a placard with some more stats on here about a 98% placement rate. It talks about scheduling a visit, um, our student-faculty ratio. So it's it's a fun way that we can get a little bit more information to the students. And it's Trip's head. This is baby Trip. This is like, I don't know, nine-week-old Trip. Looking like a little puppy. All right. Uh, this might be subject to change too. We have a bunch of different buttons, so we might just rotate to keep our stock fresh. Um, but we have this great set of. Oh, see if we're focused. I don't know if we're focused. It's far away. Uh, Butler buttons. So this one says Dream On uh, with the Butler logo on it. This one is a Butler University lockup and then Trip's Head. So this might change. We have a few buttons. Um, you might have seen those next Ticket Meal Monday. So we'll keep rotating those through. Um, another thing that might change, stickers. So this sticker set here has the old Jingo Illustration um, logo on it, the um, Butler Blue Live Mascot Program look on it, as well as the back. You can kind of see the shape of it, um, the Bulldog Head. So that is good. Um, we might rotate some other stickers in there, but uh, they're gonna get some stickers. Speaking of stickers, we have two more stickers. Here it is, I was nervous. Just a little Butler Bound sticker. This is a Sticker Mule sticker, same quality as the other ones. Um, just kind of wanted it to stay out, but just a little Butler Bound, put on your, on your water bottles. Last sticker, um, this is for the cars. And so this is a car decal. It's super hard to read and it's backwards. 
Um, it looks forward on here, so it might be right. I don't know how cameras work totally, but it's just a card decal that says I am Butler bound. Super cool, put on the back of the card when you decide to go to Butler, which you should. Three more items. I'm saving the best for last. Poster. So we have this poster here. I like it a lot. It has the bulldog face behind it, bulldog down there, trip social media handle, so I call it the social media poster. We have another poster. Um, but I kind of want to save it for some other giveaways too. So we have two posters right now. Um, the poster, uh, other post I'm talking about is actually the cover of our calendar, which I'm going to reveal the calendar to you guys next after this. Second to last item, a really cool pennant. So it's a gray and blue butler pennant, um, miniature size next to my head, you can kind of see. Uh, perfect for lockers. Um, gonna be good for your dorm room when you decide to come to Butler, which you should. And so, it's a new ad. This is totally new this year. Butler Pennants. Thanks to our friends at Emissions. So that'll be cool. And debuting to you live now. Not live, because it's, you know, YouTube. The Butler Blue 2020 calendar. It's not on the website yet, so we haven't promoted it yet, because we don't want to promote something you can't buy yet. Um, but I'll give you a little sneak peek. Here is the Butler Blue 2020 calendar. If I'm being completely honest, it is my absolute favorite calendar so far. I'll go through the, spoiler, I'm going to go through the months real quick. If you don't want to see it, skip ahead like a minute. All right. Just some general information about the Butler Blue program. Cover image, turns out to be January. Strong, warm you up, make you happy. Look at this. So that is Addie, University of Redlands Addie, Tripp's girlfriend, on a bed of roses. Come on. So that's Tripp, Addie in a picture frame, Tripp's on a bed of roses for Valentine's Day. This is a gorgeous shot um, from last year's basketball season for March for the tournament. Uh, we're going to be in it. Nice little living room scene of Tripp on a cute bed. May, of course, has to be the Art of Bricks. That just makes total sense. This is from about a year ago. We took a few different photos downtown. We just decided to, take, to load up trip in the car and head downtown. So we decided to do that and do that. And we got this. Then, Butterfly from the Alexander for July. We have Stucky Farms. Um, in Sheridan, Indiana for September. A little apple orchard action. Trip in the man, Gordon Hayward for October, usually about the start of uh, NBA season. So we got Trip in Gordo for that from last year's game. November, Trip in a turkey costume. Because gobble gobble. And then at last for December, Hinkle Field House. Gorgeous picture. This is actually from a vlog we'll post in the corner um, from when we showed you guys the best Instagram spots around Hinkle. So check that out. Well, I think that's about do it for this episode of the Butler Blue Vlog. I don't feel like I can totally wrap this without Trip though, so I'm gonna go get him. You can have this seat. Come here. Come here. Ooh. Good boy. You wanna say goodbye to the vlog? All right, everyone. Thanks for tuning in to another episode of the Butler Blue Vlog. For Michael, Brittany, Bubba Blue III, and myself, thank you for watching. Oh my goodness. Subscribe, share, like, leave a comment. Follow Trip on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, Snapchat, and as always, go dogs!